Europe, Asia, Australia, North America, South America, Antarctica, Africa. Welcome to Africa. This is your boy once again, Matthews, aka Matthew 08. If you are new on this channel, don't forget to subscribe. If you are a returning viewer, thank you very much. And in today's video, we want to cross to Malawi through Zambia here we are on the Zambian side and we are going to cross to Malawi without a passport this is the borderless Africa they've been preaching about where it is visa free otherwise enjoy the vlog it is called this vlog is called Malawi travel vlog we'll go to Malawi so I'm on the Muami side of Zambia and the other side of Malawi is called change let's enjoy right now we are even in the taxi going to the border from Chipata to Mwami Muchinji border post it's about 20 kwacha which is less than you know or equal to one dollar and this is my first time of going there we are going to call this vlog Zambia Malawi vlog because we are crossing between two countries so if you are new don't forget to subscribe if you are a returning viewer thank you very much for always returning to my channel let's go the Mwami Muchinji border post serves as a key entry point between Zambia and Malawi facilitating um, cross-border trade and travel so we are going to you know on right now we are on the zambian side and we've even reached this border you can even see that poster or billboard for zambia revenue authority or z -RA. we are going to compare the on the zambian side and on the malawan side which place looks much better and later on we'll go deep into Malawi to just walk and see what is happening otherwise the location and connectivity the Malawan or the Mwami Muchinji border post is located in the eastern province of Zambia near the town of Chipata it connects Zambia and Malawi providing a vital link between the two countries the border post is situated on the Great East Road one of the major transportation routes ensuring accessibility and connectivity for trade and commerce you know right now if you are crossing here you don't need a passport you don't need a visa you only need a pass if you are going deep into Malawi so this it's good that Africa is beginning to open up to other African countries Zambia and Malawi they are leading by example i would also want to state that when we went to nakonde to nduma border post it is the same thing because if i want to go to algeria if i want to go to morocco i don't need a visa because it is between or it is in africa this is what we want and you can see what is in front of me there it is even written pedestrian control these are just people they move between two countries freely right now i'm on the zambian side this is the entry point where i will cross going into malawi without a passport this is what we want this is what will develop africa as a continent to you know to just do away with the uh, barriers that we've created of course this is the, the immigration offices on the Zambian side and now boom I have entered Malawi and the language once you reach here the language just changes one thing that I've noticed on the Zambian side the infrastructure is still in you know old age the infrastructure is lagging behind but look at the infrastructure they have built on the malawan side and i'm hoping that the relevant authorities they will do something on the 
Zambian side because honestly speaking it is a sorry side I will not dwell so much on that because my aim is to bring content at the comfort of your or in the comfort of your homes where you cannot go we can go there so as we continue exploding we can talk about the importance of this you know border muami muchinji border post and uh, we can you know trade and commerce the muami muchinji border post is a crucial or is crucial for promoting bilateral trade between zambia and malawi at large it serves as a primary gateway for goods and commodities you will see that even people they buy things from zambia on the bicycle and cross back into malawi without any interference without confiscating their goods this is domestic you know trade but when it comes to commercial of course you have to you know uh, go through the necessary um, procedures and we are slowly approaching the terminal here in malawi on the malawian side guys it is heaven the terminal here you can even chill here but on the zambian side it is just still plain let's continue traders you know um uh, from both countries cross the border to exchange various products including agricultural produce manufactured goods and consumers products the border post plays a pivotal role in promoting economic cooperation and regional uh, integration yeah this is the side here where you can come and i think there is even you know on your right there you will see you know some immigration officers and students are uh, having classes i would like to commend both governments zambian and malawan for coming up with such a good strategy of just allowing people to pass through without any interception because this promotes trade this promotes bilateral relationship and you can even see those air cones they have everything is ultra modern on the malawan side and i'm also you know appealing to all you know african countries let's open up to each other this is the ultra modern terminal that the malawan government has built it has got almost everything but on the zambian side to be honest there is nothing to show for there no or there is no such infrastructure where you have all the services that are required and i'm hoping that the government will do something here you can even find the police post in case of cases otherwise we are still in malawi that's why this vlog is called malawi zambia vlog europe asia north america south america antarctica africa australia leave a comment and i would like to say thank you very much guys for always watching my videos because your support means a lot the more you watch the more it gives me motivation to make videos for you to show you how we live here in africa you know i only thought that where i don't need a passport or where i don't need visa to go visit another country it was in tanzania not knowing that even here in malawi you don't need a visa it is visa free all you need is a pass a pass they will ask you how many days are you going to be there then you tell them then they will give you a pass based on that yeah this is what we want so that we can be crossing visiting each other in peace now we are going deep into malawi you can even see the mountains and people uh you know walking through here others are going to zambia by bicycles on foot others 
uh, going to Zambia you know by taxis and you can even see so this guy is coming from Zambia going into Malawi and this one is a trader is just passing through without being intercepted this is not called smuggling this is domestic business yeah that's how we call it and another guy is also a cement you know supplier he has bought cement from the zambian side going to sell it right in the heart of malawi this is what we want let people do business freely let people enjoy africa because they say that visiting africa is one of the most difficult thing amongst africans why because we i require to get a visa to go to ghana i require to get a visa to go to benin i require a visa to go to algeria i require a visa to go to egypt that's why we don't even visit each other we opt to visit other european countries or our countries outside africa because we've made it difficult for ourselves to visit ourselves guys i'm enjoying the vlog here we are now deep into malawi you can even see traders are uh, selling things this is where you see real business between zambia and malawi customs and immigration the malawan or the muami muchinji border post houses customs and immigration facilities where travelers and goods are processed during border crossing customs officials enforce regulation conduct inspections and correct duties and taxes as per uh, the laws of zambia and malawi immigration authorities ensure proper documentation and control the movement of people between the two countries as i said in my preamble that if you want to go deep into malawi maybe the long way and you want to go and do business all you need is a pass you don't need a visa so you need to go to the immigration so that they put a stamp that you are going to be there for so many days just like that you don't need to apply for a visa to wait for a month just go there right there and then they will give you and you go free as you want here the only difference is you know is the language otherwise i can just see that everything is almost the same the tomatoes they are selling the potatoes you know small fish even you see here bikers there is bicycles and there are motorbikes waiting for people to hire them because they work as taxi drivers even on the zambian side you will see the same business going on this place you know we can even talk about the border post provides employment opportunities for uh, personnel involved in customs immigration security and support services border officials customs agent immigration officers transportation you know operators and service providers such as hotels restaurants and duty-free shops contribute to the local and regional economy yeah it might look like this but this place generates a lot of income for both countries if you are watching outside zambia or outside africa and you visited any of the african country leave a comment i would like to hear from you i would like to have an idea what was your experience otherwise we are enjoying working here in malawi without a passport without a pass because it is a border free because it is visa free place how the travel how is malawi malawi is good guys i thought it's only tanzania here you can cross without a passport here you can also cross guys without a passport for what traveling has made us to realize that they are open you up we are only thinking that it's only in tanzania between Nam nakonde and and the Nduma. Nduma. where you can cross without a without pass passport how wrong 
But even here, same thing. You don't need a passport. This is what we need. Yeah. Huh? This is the kind of Africa we need. Yes. So right now we are in Malawi, enjoying yeah. the language, the authenticity yeah. of Chewa of Chewa. Yes. Chewa is deep. Yes. Otherwise. Leave a comment if you've been to Malawi or you are watching from Malawi. Yes, leave a comment. And we are here in Uchinji. Yes. Yeah. We're going to find restaurants, people do business, cross-border business. Same people. Same people. And here it's even much easier because we almost speak the same language. Yeah, yes. imagine. This is the one who is Exactly. Than Tanzania. Yes, because in Tanzania there is Swahili. Language, Swahili. Yes. Here there is Chewa. For your information, there is also Tumbuka. That's why they say that Mala Malawi is an extension province of what? Yes, they say it's the province of Zambia. Zambia. I believe now. Yeah. Although it can purpose the forest. Some some people call Malawi Jipata extension. Mm. Welcome to Malawi. Malawi. And in my conclusion, I would say that the Mwami Muchinji border posts uh, economic significance lies in its role as a vital trade link connecting Zambia and Malawi, promoting regional trade integration and facilitating cross-border movement. It serves as a gateway for commerce, enhances economic cooperation and contributes to the social economic development of both countries and the wider region. I think after visiting the Tanzania Zambia border, Malawi Zambia border, I feel as an African we should introduce visa Yes, visa free, visa free entry so that we can be traveling among African countries in very peace. People they say borderless, yes, we say borderless. What do they mean when they say borderless? Visa free. Visa free movement. Yes. Otherwise, you need a visa to go to, to your neighboring country. Or to go to Algeria. Or to Imagine. go to Nigeria. I need to get a visa. No, we don't need that. So guys, this is what I wanted to show that it is very possible to cross from Zambia to Malawi without a pass. You only need a pass if you are going deep into Malawi. Yes. Malawi. Yes. This, which is a very good thing. Yeah. And one thing that I've observed is on the Malawian side, the border is on perfect. Like it's on point. But ours, the Zambian side, it's a sunny side. No. Actually, these guys have made very beautiful one. Yes. It's very beautiful on the... Um, mm -hmm. It's very beautiful on the... On the Malawi side, yes, compared to our Zambian, our side. Zambian side. So, guys, we can do better. Yeah, we mm. can. If Malawi can do it, we can do, do it. it. We can. If Malawi we can did, also, if Malawi Malawi did, did it, we can, can also do it. it. So, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new and if you are a returning viewer. Thank you very much. See you in the next video. This was the Malawi travel vlog before the mobile boots they put air tail they put air tail exactly like even air tail is working yes okay. imagine zam tail going yeah now it was zam tail and it's